Yo, what up? What's poppin'? Back at it again with a quick sports-related video for y'all. And But first and foremost, Grand Rising is Sunday. I know a lot of y'all waking up on this Sunday morning, getting ready to go out to church, give the Lord praise, and hear the word of the Lord. I just wanted to share something with y'all because... I know a lot of you football fans are excited. College football is back and the pro football season starts some um, next week. Like I said before, <clears throat> I had I had stopped watching sports the way that I used to, but I'm, I'm, I'm trying to get back into sports. I mean, I used to play sports. Is sports a part of me? Is sports a part of my life? Yes. I played football for six years and I thought football was something that I wanted to do, but I ended up not enjoying football the way I thought I would. So I found music and I found YouTube. So I just want to share something with y'all. When it comes down to like college football, high school football, and even the pros, but not just in football, pretty much in all sports. When it comes down to like a high school or a college not having like a football team, because I noticed this watching the this college football game yesterday between UNC Charlotte and James Madison. UNC Charlotte is a college that used to not have a football team, but now they do. They ended up losing to James Madison 30 to 7. And, you know, what I mean, it was a blowout, but I just want to share something. When it comes down to being a sports fan, sometimes fans. When, when they're rooting for their favorite team, when they're cheering for their favorite team, sometimes they can, you know, get like a like a little too enthusiastic to the point where they might even say some disrespectful stuff to the players. But I just want to share something with y'all because I'm pretty sure like to those of y'all out there that used to play football or even if you're even if you're like a former coach, you probably know this, too. When it comes down to like um like a college or a high school and sometimes even in the pros when it comes down to like a a school or a college like 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 they used to not have like a football team but now they're just now starting up a football team and when but not just in football in any sport when 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 the football team or the basketball team is just now starting up and when the team is like in full effect when they're getting ready to have their first official season sometimes the season may not be successful because they're still building up the program and it seems that's what that's what's going on with UNC Charlotte was I was I rooting for UNC Charlotte yesterday yes I was I was rooting for my favorite team but, you know, what I mean, they lost and I, I, I understand. I understand. I realize that they used to not have a football team and they're still doing what they got to do to build up the program. Recruiting, um, like uh, coaching the players up, you know, what I mean, practicing every day, studying film, uh, doing what they got to do to like build up the program. They're still building up as a program because. They used to not have a football team. University of North Carolina, Charlotte. Yeah, I mean, they, they used to yeah not have a football team at all. But now, well, as a matter of fact, this is not even UNC Charlotte's first official season. I think this is probably maybe like... Uh, I guess maybe their fifth season, but or sixth season. But again, they're still building up the program. They're still building up. They're still building up the program, the football program. You know, what I mean, and and it, and it takes time. It takes time. It takes years. You know, when they keep building and building and building over the years, they'll get better to the point well, where they'll even make it to a conference championship or even a bowl game. You know, I mean, you know, it just takes time to build up. But you see, 
you got some of these athletes out here and you got some of these sport fans that be thinking that that they can win it all, that their team can win it all. People still don't realize that you win some, you lose some. People still don't realize that you can't win them all. People still have trouble realizing that and people still have trouble understanding and grasping that. Don't get me wrong. I understand. I know how it is being a competitor. When I was playing football my sophomore year at the JV level, I was a competitor. When it came down to me having a starting position, I wanted to win it all. I wanted to win it all, especially when it was the conference championship. I wanted to win. I wanted to win that game, and we did win that game. I wanted to show all of the doubters wrong. I wanted to prove all of the doubters wrong, all of the haters wrong, and we won the conference championship. I was a champion, like, you know what I mean? But yeah, but yeah, I mean, you know, it's... It's just, it just takes time for the program to build up. And UNC Charlotte, they just got to keep building up their program. I mean, yeah, they lost against James Madison yesterday, 30-7. to 7, But they just have to build up the program. Sometimes with some of these college football teams and even... And, and even with some of these high school football teams, they don't really like expect to be good every single season because they have to like keep building up the program. They got to keep building up. But you see, when it comes to college football teams like Alabama, Ohio State, they expect to be good every season. Ohio State, they always dominate in college football. The Buckeyes, they never disappoint. Ohio State won yesterday with a blowout. You know what I mean? And, and Alabama won yesterday too. But you see, Alabama, Ohio State, they expect to be good every single season. But yeah, the program just has to build up. But I just wanted to share this sports-related video for y'all. This is a video... This is a video that goes out to all of the the college football fans, the pro football fans, even the football players out there. You a parent watching this video and you got a you got your son playing football. I just wanted to share this video for y'all to let y'all know to explain. Don't forget, like, subscribe, hit the notification bell on my channel, comment, share, like the video. Love y'all.